it's fall. I, don't, I can't remember the last time I vlogged. I'm currently studying for my national boards part two, which I have on Monday. I don't feel ready for this exam, but there is there are no available dates unless I wanna take it in January or February. And if I do that, if I wait until next year, I won't have an opportunity to retake the exam in case I don't pass. So I don't know, I'm really doing myself a disservice if I do that. So basically I feel like I have to take this exam on Monday. So I'm just gonna try my best. And here I am procrastinating by making a video. Let me show you Bagel. He's like the biggest distraction, but he's like the cutest thing ever. It is the day before my national boards part two exam. I'm exhausted, but I have to get through this. Only a couple more hours until I can go to sleep and then I'm gonna take this exam. I'm gonna pass and then we'll be done with day one of this exam, but we'll still have day two on Thursday. I can't wait to be done. I'm not feeling the best, but I'm also not feeling the worst. I've definitely felt worse. Luckily, my hands aren't hurting too much. They've only been a little bit sore, so I've had to change up how I study. So instead of writing notes when I study, I've just been reading stuff like reading my notes out loud and recording myself on voice memo and then I've been listening to myself through my airpods like through those voice memo notes that I've been reading out loud just repetition that's what I've been doing good morning it is test day it's so freaking cold it was raining this morning I just parked it's like seven in the morning my test starts at eight I got here early because I'm known to like get lost, get off the wrong exit. So I wanted to make sure that I got here on time. Now I have to look for the building. Um, I've never been to this testing center. Center. I'm in Glendale. It's really pretty here. There's a lot of nice buildings, some cool sculpture right there. I couldn't get an appointment at the one in Culver City, which is closer to my house because all the spots are filling up. So I'm in Glendale, but luckily I didn't have to drive too far. I know some people had to drive like hours and hours to get a spot to take this test. Hi you guys, I just got done. It's like 4 p.m. I'm so tired and exhausted and I don't remember anything from this test. Like. I just took a 400 question test. I don't remember anything except for like one thing. And I looked it up and tramadol binds to mu opioid receptors. And I'm so upset because I got that question wrong. Um, ah, I'm so annoyed about that because I knew that tramadol is classified like as a class four drug. So I assumed it wasn't like an opioid or it, it's not an, I don't think it's considered an opioid, but I I was wrong. Anyways, that was just one question. The test was brutal. I don't know. I feel like maybe I just got an unlucky test. So we'll see. I feel like it's going to be curved or it is going to be curved. Of course, I still have day two of my test on Thursday. Today's Monday. Ah, that test was brutal. It really was brutal. Hi guys. So I have the second day of my board exam tomorrow and I don't know what to study for it. I've asked people like, how should you study for the second day? And most people have said that you can't really study for it. So I kind of wish I took my test back to back or at least just had one day in between instead of having two days in between because my part my first day was on Monday and my second day is on Thursday. That's like too many hours in between and I don't really know what to study and I'm missing clinic. So instead I'm just watching mental dental videos and hanging out with my dog. But yeah, how I'm choosing to study because I am trying to study a little bit is I'm watching mental dental videos. I'm watching some INBD mental dental videos actually. Um, mostly just pharmacology videos and trying to look at radiographs because the second day is just 
cases. Apparently I'm supposed to just know it or I don't know it. So I feel like the only thing I can really study are drugs like pharmacology. Hey guys, it is day two of my NBDE exam. I'm on my 15 minute break right now. I probably have like five minutes left, um, but I just went to a little cafe downstairs and I got some fruit. So I'm gonna eat my fruit really fast and then finish up my test. I'm also outside getting some sunshine. When I took my test on Monday, it was raining. So I didn't get to go outside. The second day of this exam is way easier than the first day. The first day was absolutely brutal. I was so sad like that night and the day after because I really felt like I didn't pass. But the second day, I feel like I'm doing really well. So uh, I'm hoping that it makes up for day one. You guys, I just finished that 12 hour exam. I'm so excited. I feel so much better than I did after day one. I was so bummed after day one. It was raining. I still had another day to do, but day two was way easier. The second half of day two was harder than the first half, but it still was better than day one. Day one was just so brutal, but I'm excited that I'm done. I just really hope I pass. Now I have to go to clinic and Actually, I have to relax and celebrate first. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I'm, I should be really proud of myself for being able to study and being able to take this 12 hour exam. Like I can't believe I'm at this stage. I was looking at my computer and it said, National Dental Board Examination, part two, day two. Like I can't believe I've taken this exam. I've taken the first part of this exam. I've taken, the first day of this exam. I've taken the DAT before this exam. Like I've taken so many tests to get to this point. And it's just crazy that I'm here and that I'm almost going to graduate. So I'm proud of myself. I should be proud of myself. And if you guys are pursuing dentistry, you guys will be in this position soon enough and it's gonna go by super fast and it, it's just crazy how, how fast it goes. And I don't know, I don't know how I got here. <laughs> like, how am I taking this second board exam? I really hope I pass. I just got an email saying that my NBDE part two scores are up. Uh, so I'm gonna check that soon. I'm very nervous. You guys, I checked my score for NBDE part two and I passed. I passed, I don't have to take this test again.